Dr. Kim Schreier was the woman of the hour Sunday at the Chelan County Democratic Headquarters. But this wasn't a victory lap. It was a thank you from the freshman congresswoman-elect to the volunteers who knocked on doors, posted signs, and otherwise got out the vote in eastern Washington. I won for a whole lot of reasons, but I believe that the most critical was that this became a movement, that this could be 4,000 volunteers, and I wish I could give every single one of them a hug. That effort helped flip the 8th Congressional District, which has elected a Republican every two years since 1982 in favor of the Democratic pediatrician from Sammamish. She won over Dino Rossi by almost a 5% margin. We had unbelievable voter turnout, and I will be forever grateful. And I just want to keep the momentum so we can do this again in 2020. Bill Miller, the chairman of the Chelan County Democrats, said putting a candidate over the top has fired up local party members. They're energized, they're happy with who was elected, they want to make sure she is successful, uh, they want to work for her again, there's people that want to help with the municipal elections coming up, it has absolutely energized our group. So much so that the Democrats are looking to keep their current headquarters in place through 2019. Previously, the party has only opened an office location during national election cycles. Schreier says she wants to focus on health care and agriculture when seeking committee appointments in the new Democratic House of Representatives. We really need somebody to focus on hay and wheat and orchards because right now the focus is really on corn and soy and cotton and sugar and there's so much more here. I am honored and delighted to take this on. This is an exciting time here in Washington, D.C. The freshman class is incredible, diverse, but we all want to deliver for our districts and we all are there to shake things up and do good. Jefferson Robbins, iFiber One News.